Hello everyone! In the new version of eCycles, you now have a new option which is called High Quality Pass. It's activated by default, it's for the AI denoiser, and as the name says, it's for high quality denoising. So, let's start by using optics first. We are using 9 samples with optics, and let's see what the results are already. I'm rendering on the 2080 Ti, so it would be a bit slow. I will try to render on a 3090 later on. So here, as you can see, Optics is really doing already a good job from a few samples here with a lot of dark areas. It already produces pretty detailed textures, but you still have some blurry areas here. It also left some fireflies here and generally um, you have um, too much contrast sometimes so here for example it's exa exaggerated here on this texture it shouldn't be so visible here so sometimes it's too sharp and sometimes it's too blur blurry uh, compared to what it should look like So it takes about what minute four to render. To use the new AI denoiser, you just click on create and render again. So here we have the same soup of pixels with a lot of missing information. And let's see what the new option will do. Here it is. So I'm on a 4K monitor, so the resolution is pretty high actually. I will try to zoom in for the video to better see the difference. So here you have optics with the couch and the blurry areas. And this is the eCycles AI denoiser. This is the wood with the AI denoiser, with the right hue and here with the optics. You ha also have some lines here which are gone with the high quality denoising. The fireflies in the optics version are removed also by the high quality pass. Here the details. Optics high quality e-cycles AI denoiser. So as you can see now with nine samples only, you can get really good results. It's really good for preview. Of course, for final render, you can use more than nine samples. It's just to show how the new option behaves. I hope you like it and I wish you happy rendering with it. Have a nice day. See you.